Hey guys, Andrew here with Unlocked, your daily key to open up your heart to God. Have you ever heard the name Habakkuk? Or Habakkuk, depends on who you talk to about how you pronounce this one. Well, Habakkuk, or Habakkuk, was a prophet of God in the Old Testament. Now, this guy from a few thousand years ago with a difficult-to-pronounce name, and even harder-to-spell name, is actually who our devotion is about today. It's called Questions for God, and it was written by Rosemary Pajano. A deer's impressive hooves allow her to sprint across an open field at 30 miles per hour. If threatened, she can actually leap over a six-foot fence and maneuver through rough, hilly terrain to get to a safe place. But where's our safe place? Every nook and cranny in our world is vulnerable. Tragedies are broadcast on the news every day. When trials and troubles hit close to home and affect us personally, we question, what's going on? I mean, where, where is God? Why doesn't he do something? The prophet Habakkuk was a man of questions. He was burdened by what he saw going on with God's people. They were suffering, even as the wicked seemed to go unpunished. He could not understand this injustice, so he questioned God. Why? God answered Habakkuk by making it clear that he was moving in a definite way. He has a purpose, and he intends to carry it through. Habakkuk, in his prayer, accepted that no matter what the circumstance, he would walk by faith and trust God. God has a purpose for your life, too. God is just, so he's working everything together for good in his kingdom. He promises one day to bring justice for every wrong done and to free his people and all of creation from sin, suffering, and death when he returns. We see that in passages like Romans chapter 8 or 1 Corinthians chapter 4 verse 5. Our place of safety comes when we hold on to our faith in the promise of Jesus Christ, looking to him for strength. What an encouragement to know we can rejoice in him and in his salvation found in Jesus Christ. So let's talk about this. What questions do you have for God? What are some difficult circumstances or obstacles you're facing now? Why would Habakkuk want his feet to be like deer's feet in a difficult time? That question there is referring to Habakkuk chapter 3 verse 19, which says, The sovereign Lord is my strength. He makes me as sure-footed as a deer, able to tread upon the heights. Now, I'd encourage you to read through Habakkuk chapter 2, verse 4, and chapter 3, verses 17 through 19 to help keep God's word alive in your life. Unlocked is a service of Keys for Kids Ministries. Check out the resources we've got in our app. You can just search on the App Store for Unlocked. And until next time, I'm Andrew, encouraging you to live life unlocked, opening the door to God in your life. Oh,